And I love hats, but I've got a tiny head, so I can't go into a regular store and get a hat to wear. I found people here and there that could teach me different techniques. There's myself, and then there's another um, woman down in Bishop Arts. There's not a lot of us. So my name is Jenny Matheson Foster, um, and I own Bay Willow Design, which is a millinery studio. There are so many different things that you can do with hat making, from felt hats to straw hats. It's a field that there's con it's constantly changing, and I'm constantly learning new things. Well, I make from anything from a simple straw hat. This is a cute little um, trilby. Or this, well this one's not finished yet, there's even this kind of fancy felt hat to, you know, your casual summer hats and straw or to even, oops, a fancy derby hat. The length of time that it takes to make a hat really depends on the material. This is a real uh, simple hat right here. This one is taking longer because I bought two hats, cut them in half so we can do the dual color. But if you really want to do fancy, like things like this will take me um, about three to four days. Straw hats can start in the, the mid 100s. And you go fancier, um, a lot of it may not be so much the materials, but it's the amount of time that it's taking to make it. I hand sew everything. Um, I do have a sewing machine here, but I rarely will use the sewing machine for a hat. I think the handmade quality, the hand sewing, um, if you're having a custom hat made, I think that's what you want. So what's really popular right now this is out of real heavyweight, western weight for felt. They're just fun and they're adorning them with you know, lots and loads of stuff and fun stuff. But it's, it's a fun hat, casual hat to wear since we're not going anywhere fancy. <laughs> casual hats are great. It's a great, great community here. I'm loving it. I live in the historic district. The people are so friendly, so inviting, so supportive of the arts also. Well, I always said that this is for my COVID haircut one night before I got a cut. I could, you know, just cover it all up. We might as well have fun, look great, and not worry about what your hair looks like.